Alright, um, continuing uh, the welding operations two um, AIPD course, uh, figure one, an Eric gas metal arc welding electrode holder. Direct current welding, indirect welding, uh, indirect current welding, the welding, direct welding current may be hooked up to either the straight polarity, direct current, straight polar, reverse polarity. The direct current, straight, straight polarity, machine connects the electrode negative work base of this. The shown in figure two, view A1 on the following page, the electron. Figure V2 shows the current polarity and effects. Uh, straight polarity, deep penetrations, and uh, reverse polarity, shallow, wide. Well, uh, reverse polarity view A and straight polarity, um, flowing the circuit if you want for the connection with the electrode to the workpiece base metal with the plate with the direct reverse polarity of the welding machine connects the electrode positive with the workplace negative. Workpiece negative is shown in figure 2 VA with the electron flow when the circuit is flowing the workpiece for the electrode straight polarity welding electrons hitting the plate at the high velocity exert a considerable heating effect of the plate in reverse polarity of the welding on the opposite of the curve of the electrode will curve for the extra high heat which tends to melt out the end of the electrode thus if they give him the amount of welding current of the east direct current reverse polarity requires a large diameter electrode with a direct current so the straight polarity for example the 1 16th of an inch diameter per tungsten electrode Electrode can be ha uh, handled 125 amp of the welding current the under straight polarity condition, but if the amount of the current is reversed, it would melt the electrode and contaminate the, the welded metal at one and quarter inch of the um, diameter pier with the tungsten large. However, the can, can handle the amount of the current satisfactorily safely while the heavy electrode electrode yield the composition coating with the gases produced to alter the heat condition producing greater than on the negative side of the arc. One type of the coating may be provided with the desirable heat balance for the straight polarity with another type of the coating on the same electrode with the provide desirable heat balance with the, with the reverse polarity. These opposite heating effects influence not only the welding action but also the shape of the weld obtained. For example, the direct current so straight polarity welding produces a narrow deep of the weld as shown. Figure 2 view B1 over the three of its page. Because of the large electrode of the low current, the generally even the direct current reverse polarity welding gives a wide, uh, relatively shallow weld as shown in Figure 2 VB2. One of the other effect of the direct current reverse polarity welding should be considered the highly here, namely so called cleaning effect that seems to occur. But the after, although the effect of the reason surface is cleaning action not known it seems preferably and probably either the electron leaving the plate of the gas ion striking the plate intending to break up the surface oxide scale and dirt usually present E in general, straight polarity with the mild steel bare thin coated electron reverse polarity, but is used welding such as non fierce metal with aluminum, bronze, and model, model nickel and reverse polarity is also used the use sometimes electrode for vertical overhead welds. The proper polarity of an electrode can be recognized by the shape of sharp cracking around the arc with the wrong polarity will cover the arc to emit hitting sound, but the welding bead will be difficult to control. Three alternating current welding theoretically combined with the direct current straight polarity, direct current reverse polarity. Well, they, this is the they can be the best explained shown with the three current wave that's shown figure three view A with the following page of the S each of the complete alternating current cycle of deep is the direct current straight polarity and other half the direct current reverse polarity. Moisture oxide scales, etc. on the surface of the plate tend to prevent the hair partially complete with the flow of the current of the reverse polarity direction. This is called re 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 rectification. For example, the no current allow all flowed with the reverse polarity direction of the current wave of the will would also look something like shown in figure view 3B. To prevent rectification occurring with the common practice is introduce an additional high voltage, high vo frequency, high lower polar power current with the wind of the welding current, the high frequency current jump with the gap between the electrode work waste, um, pieces and pieces of the oxide film, therefore a finding path of the welding current with the flow of the superimposed, the highly voltage frequ high frequency current for the welding and current give the following advantages. The arc may be started without touching the electrode of the workplace. Two, the bar bar better arc stability obtained. Three, the uh, longer arc with the possible, the practical, useful surfacing hard facing operation for electrode has a longer life five the use of the welding current range of the specific diameter electrode is possible five welding contour a typical while the contour produces a procedure of the high frequency stabilized alternating current shown in figure view three view c1 and but our direct current straight polarity direct current reverse polarity welds are shown in figure three view c2 and three for the comparison penetration contract and the network ac and dc welds Figure 3 shows the AC rectified AC wave comparison of the weld ranks. A, R, AC welding direct, direct current straight polarity, direct current reverse polarity. View A, direct current straight, straight polarity. Um, amps and time, amps and times, direct current reverse polarity. One complete cycle of the AC. And view B, amps, time, and a complete cycle of the rectified AC. Filler rod. Sometimes enough amp metal to provide the design joint form the welded bead out with the filler melt to the edge. Add the bare rod for the handling and freeing of the bolt from in the form of the coil wire automatically 
likely feeding in the villa arrived during the welding and heat joint design generally the type of the welding joints that we use in the t- tungsten in an air gas welding operation five basking basic type of the joint butt lap at the corner edge of the T that are used within the other welding process almost and heat take welding will be with one combination two or more of the five basic sets, uh, types the selection of the proper design for the particular application depending on the primary flowing factors physical properties desired for the weld type of the metal being weld the size and shape appearance the assembly of the weld fill or metal in a form of the welding rod not needed to be used with the proper reinforcement complete fusion edges that can be obtained without the joints described in less than about or but a few many of the successful tons in air gas welding they do however the represent mostly frequently used many of the variations of these types can be used with the fully special special job requirements. True cleaning, proper cleaning of the workpiece, proper of the welding, essential for the weld, good appearance, physical property to be obtained, the ums- or small assembly, manual cleaning of the wire, brush steel, wool, chemical solvent, usually sufficient for large assembly cleaning of the production base of the vapor, the decreasing tank plant, cleaning may be more economically, in any case, be sure of the complete removal of all oxide scale, oak cream, oil, grease, dirt, rust, and other form material, um, form matter um, from the work surface. Square butt jo- joint. Figure four with the view A with the following page for the square butt joint, but the easiest prepared that can be welded with without filler metal, but depending on the thickness of the base metal being welded with the joint fitted up with the type of the joint should be always be true enough to assure one hundred percent of the penetration and in good fusion with the welding light gauge material without adding filler metal extreme care should be taken to avoid low spots of the burning through the heavier thickness will generally require filler metal to provide adequate reinforcement. Sleeve, uh, single V butt joint. The single V butt joint, you for the complete penetration required with the material thickness ranging from a quarter to three eighths of an inch filler rod must be used with the V and V in the included angle V, but it should be approximately 60 degrees for the nose of the measure with one eighth to one quarter inch depending on the composition and thickness of the base metal being welded. Figure four shows the bolt, 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 um, butt joints. Double B, uh, double V bun joint. The double V bun joint is generally with the one stock half an inch, but um, and up the way the design assembly being welded permits access as the back of the joint for the second pass with the type of the joint and proper the welding technique to ensure the good sound weld is 100% fusion. Lab joint. Figure four of you see with the previous page. Lab joint is advantage to limiting the need for the edge preparation. The only requirement of making the good lab the weld is the plate is to be enclosed with the contact along with the entire length of the joint and to be welded on more material one fourth of an inch or less thickness of the lab joints can be made without with a with there without um with or without filler rod, no filler rod, you but the care must be taken to avoid the spots and burn through. The lab type of the joint is not usually recommended material thickness than one fourth then except the rough fit up when you but the filler rod must allow always be you to ensure the good fusion build up and the number of the passes required with depending on thickness of the piece of the base metal being joined. Five corner joint. Figure five of the view A of the following page. Corner joints are frequently used with the fabrication panel, but pane boxes, and all types of the containers as well. The other heavier for purpose of the number of the pass subscribe with depending on the size of the V, the thickness of the base metal, and all other corner joints. Be sure that the piece of the good contact along with the entire edge. The edge joint. Figure five. The UB. View B, edge of the joints are slowly joint like um, light gauge metals can be viewed well without use of the filler metal. So, since no filler rod metal is required, penetration is simple and the joint is economically welded. R7T, right, all T joints require additional fill of the rod provided necessary build up the metal between the workpiece for the base metal with the weld of the number of the pads for each of the pad side of the joint depending on the thickness of the base metal with the material being welded with the side of the welding desire the 100% penetration required but to be sure that the welding current values are adequate thickness for the base and equipment the basement equipment required with the manual t- t- tungsten and air gas welding is shown in view A figure 6 consistent welding torch electrical power supply shielding gas water supply safety equipment should be used protecting against, uh, against arc rays during the welding operation Figure 5 shows the corner edge and T-joints. Um, 2. Argon gas is supplied with a steel cylinder containing approximately 330 cubic feet of pressure of the 2,000 psi pounds per square inch. Single two-stage regulator may be used to control the gas flow. A specially designed regulator containing the flow meter shown in view B of the figure 6 of the following page may be used for the damage of the flow meter to provide better gas flow. Control the flow meters calibrated with the cubic feet for out with the current flow of the argon of the torch to set the turning. Adjusting screw of the regulator, the rate of flow um, depends on the kind of thickness for the metal to be w- welded. 2. The blanket and welding area provide 
the safe flow with Argon Ice directed with the welding towards the page figure page 7 on page 21. The synth Argon is somewhat heavier than the air pushed with the light air, air at molecules aside with the described in paragraph 3a on the page 5, thereby affecting the preventing oxidization of the welding electrode. Molten welded pool heat affected zone adjacent with the welded B. The tremendous heat of the arc of the high current all is usually necessity water cooling of the torch as shown in figure 7. The circ water circulated through the passage of the torch cool the torch. The electro power capable to ha handle any of the torch for the cooling water, however, the must be claimed with the prevent blocking and passaging of the may overheat with the damage of the torch. Staining and filtering of the water, this source has been recommended for the cleaning of the foreign matter with the might clog the using the well up on the welding torch. Live, since intermediate direct support, IDS, or intermediate general support, IGS, field are not always proximately public water source, portable, potable, soil contained water cooling system are available to field use. Um, portable systems consider the water storage tank with circulating pump. If such a system is used for the recommend, recommended for the antifreeze being the water during the winter months to prevent it from seizing further water pressure, some tungsten and inert gas welding systems must be regulated less than 55 psi. Therefore, water pressure regulator is required the type of the water pressure regulator to be used for the each tank in tungsten and air gas welding system specified pertaining to operators equipment operators manual. Um, figure six of the gas tungsten uh, arc welding equipment. Pressure gauge flow meter, um, torch cable operator, torch cable water outlet, argon hose welding crate, cable welding inlet cable, water supply, power supply, um, argon gas supply. Torch nomenclature, nomenclature 1. The cap is made with the plastic shield with the tungsten electrode to prevent the escape of the gas from the top of the torch. Also, the locks for the electrode in place. 2. The collet. Collet is made of copper. The electrode is filled inside with the collet with the cap and tightened with the collet. Squeeze with the gains of the electrode, locking the electrode in place. Alright, this shows the take, take welding torch. Our gas orifice nut. The gas orifice nut allows the gas to escape out of the torch with the gas flow, um, flow value, valve nut. And shown in figure 7 in the previous page is open. Four gas nozzle. The gas nozzle directs the field, showing the gas on the welding pool. The top of the nozzle is given the one light duty welding is made with the ceramic material. One of the heavy duty welding is water cooled copper nozzle. Five. The torch handle. The torch handle is made of plastic, reduced the chain of the ground, ground, grounding. Grounding the torch. Four, for six, the hose and three plastic hoses connected inside of the torch handle carry the water gas. The accommodated electric power cable. The electric power cable is located inside of the water drain line. This allows the cable to stay cool while carrying high amper current. Starting there, figure eight on the next page. Alternating current with the alternating current with the electrode does not have to touch with the work workpiece to start the light, or, or does not have to touch the workpiece to start the arc. Superimposed high frequency currents jump in the gap between the welding electrode and the work of the establishing the path of the welding current with the flow of the strike arc of the first. Turn the power supply holding the torch in horizontal position about two inches above the workpiece for the start block is shown in figure eight of the view. The quickly swinging of the end of the torch down with the tour of the workpiece so that the end of the electrode is about one eighth of the inch above the plate is shown in figure eight of the view. Eight, the arc will then strike one. Some alternating current welding pin machines electrode must be monetarily touched by plate with the wood drawn one eighth of an inch before the arc will start. The downward motion should be made rapidly to provide maximum amount of gas attempt protection of the welding zone when aluminum. Welding aluminum initial arc struck on the start, starting block to heat the electrode when the arc is then broken and reignited into the welded joint. Do direct current when using the direct current with the same motion of use the striking with the arc and alternate current in the case however the electrode must touch the workplace in order to the arc to start as soon as the arc is struck. Figure six shows starting the arc the starting of the swing with a swing of a swing and an end of the swing. With the draw electrode approximately one eighth of an inch above the workpiece of the void contamination electrode with the molten pool. One welding technique, additional arc can be struck with the start with the blocking heat of electrode. The start block can be heavy to piece with the copper scrap of the seal, designing for the carbon block with the starting the arc as the electrode becomes the contaminated, causing the arc to wander with what becomes difficult to control after. Striking the arc on the starting block, the arc broken and reignited with the weld to join the technique, technique reproduces the tendency of the tungsten inclusion to curve the start of the weld. When starting to weld, the hot electrode rapidly moves the torch of the welding position, becomes the arc stand for the strike before the tongue towards the proper welding position to stop the arc with the snap torch quickly back with the horizontal position the motion must be made rapidly so that the arc will not more or dam may may or damage the welding surface of the, of the workpiece keep the arc short for the same of the length of the diameter of the tungsten electrode may being used the short arc is essential to attain sufficient and penetrating from the weld in the base metal also prevents undercutting the excessive widening of the weld bead which will result in the loss of penetration control and welding contour in addition to the short arc ensure the inert gas completely shields around surrounded with the welding and welding being formed establishing three maintaining establishing the suitability of the welded pool important with the welding must be proceeded to the head of the puddle of the after the molten pool form 
forms most steadily along the seam of the gun tungsten position at an angle between 60 and 90 degrees of the plate. It should be positioned pointed directly out of direction on the filler rod. Filler rod metal may be added to the front of the leading edge of the pool, but one side of the center line with both hands removed in unison with a slight bleed back forward motion along the joint. The tungsten electrode should not touch the filler rod and the filler rod should not be withdrawn by the argon shield. For thick sections, which require multiple passes for the form of suitable bead or best welded within air gas shield with the arc, um, can use in consuming a wool electrode section of moderate thickness between 1 16th and 3 16th of an inch can be welded at any of the commercial process available. Resistance spot seam welding is used with successful on metals up to 3 16th of an inch, but metal piece with 1 half an inch thick may be also spotted welded. When arc is broken, shrinkage cracks may occur with the welded crater resulting in defective weld. The defective can be prevented by gradually lengthening the arc while for adding the filler metal to the crater quickly breaking and restriking the arc several times, adding some additional filler metal into the crater by using the foot control to reduce the current at the end of the weld. Tagging before the welding held with control distortion tack weld should be aimable size. Strength should be chipped out with a tamper to end of the weld over. Five metal and inert gas arc welding. Generally, the welding process is relatively new, only where recently has been adopted by the U.S. Army in the field. Much use for the welding process has been, will be made with a pair of aluminum hull track vehicles. Gas metal arc welding are, are MIG welding process in which the consumable bare wire electrode is fed into the weld at a controlled rate speed of blanket of an air gas and argon aluminum mixture of the two even then take welding shield with the welding zone examination of the process procedure high welding how welds without use of flux and necessity for the post cleaning of the weld are the um, metal and air gas welding um, unit is designed for the manual welding and um, with a small diameter with a wire electrode with a um, Using spool on gun torch with the shown figure nine with the following page of the MIG welding system this was well located away from the torch gun but the principal operation was the same. And for the type of the system discussed here, the complete system with the consistent torch voltage control box of welding contact is shown on figure page ten of the page twenty nine. The torch handle contains a complete motor gear reduction unit that pulls the welding wire electrode up from four inch diameter spools extending one pound of wire electrode mounted in the rear of the torch. Three basic size for the electrode may be you three thirty two and three sixty four and one sixteenth of an inch. The type of the metal may be welded provided with the welding wire electrode in the same composition base metal. The unit the design with the use of the A C D C conventional constant current the type of the welding power supply they type of the, this means that they are gasoline engine driven. Alright, MIG welding torch, figure nine. Arc welding machines issued with the field unit may be used for the power source of the welding server. The MIG welding equipment components contact tube. The tube is made with the copper of the hole of 100 to 200 of the inch large electrode. Contact tube with the guide of the bushing must be charged with the changing side of the electrode. Electrical power transmitted through the contact tube. Electrode insulated locker. Lock screw secure with the contact tube with the no of the torch. Uh, nozzle hole. The nozzle is made with the copper dissipate heat chromium plated reflecting heat. With the holder is made with the stainless steel and connected with the insulation material, which prevents the arc from being between the nozzle and ground. In the case of the gun, it comes in contact with the work and let out the gun gu guided bun bushings. Bushings are made with a nylon long wire. They must be chained to suit the way the wire electrode size when electrode is size is changed. For a pressure roll assembly, this smoother roller under pressure spring tension is smooth. The push of the wire electrode against the feet allows the wire to pull the bolt from the spool with the thumb shoe a thumb screw. Apply the tension as required. Fire the motor more when an inch button to depress the current, but the running of the motor comes with the 110 volt AC DC sort of the motor split pulls the wire electrode with the spool as required. Ready to feed the current with the motor is supplied with the welding generator. Six, the spool enclosure assembly. This assembly is made of plastic, which prevents the spatter from the jamming the wire electrode with the spool. Small windows apply operating with the visual check for the amount of the wire electrode remaining on the spool. No, if any of the reason why the wire electrode stops the feeding of that burn back, it will result. The trigger that depressed with the welding contractor closed with allowing the welding current to flow with the contact of the tube as well as the wire electrode of the instant through the tube. Electro, electro, the, the arc will be drawn by the end of the wire electrode. However, the wire electrode stops feeding, fe feeding while the trigger is being, still being depressed. The arc will then form an end of the contact tube, causing it to melt off. The last action is called a burn, act, burn back. 
7. Welding contact. The positive cable for the DC generator that is connected with the cable component of the welding contactor with the ground cable connecting with the welder P work P for the electrode cable whose welding contactor cable are connected. Between the welding contactor the voltage control box with the electrode cable enter the weld welding current relay contact the argon supply both then go out of the voltage control box into the torch and there is one online gun. Online. One on one line. Or argon ga gas um, hole, hole oh, to the hose and is connected with the voltage control back the argon gas regulator of the argon cylinder. Nine, the voltage pickup of the cable. The cable must be attacked with the ground cable. The piece of the workpiece for the service the supply with the current need to operate the motor feeding with the wire electrode through the torch. Ten, the torch switch for the ground cable. The torch switch for the cable. Um, sw the torch switch cable is connected with the voltage control box. The torch ground cable is connected with the case, um, case of the voltage control box. The complete MIG welding system is shown in figure ten with the following page. C operating MIG torch for the starting welder to operate the torch. Start pressure the in press pressing the inch for the button into the torch handle to, to permit the well wire electrode to merge with the nozzle. The wire should extend with one half of the inch and beyond the end of the nozzle. This with while the main line switching the on position the argon gas proper port power sources adjust properly operated being welded. Two of the welding open air with the protective screen must be installed install to prevent the argon gas from being blown down away from the welding zone. Pressure the torch trigger trigger to permit the current flow through the torch switch cable through the contactor cable. Close contactor four. The contractor close the wet, um with the welding circuit with the generator. The welding torch is complete. Eight, five. At the same time, the contactor closes the shielding gla gas solenoid valves open, allowing the flow of argon gas to mass out of the nozzle shield of the welded zone. All right. Figure ten shows the MIG welding system. Alright, lower welding helmet touching the end of the wire electrode workpiece. The gun has held at a 90 degree angle with the, with the work point at 100 degree and 100, at 100 angle toward the line of the travel. The welding will continue along with the arc that is maintained with the trigger is depressed. Caution prevent overloading the torch motor when stopping the arc, release the trigger, never snap the arc out or remain the torch without reverse releasing the trigger. Desetting the wire electrode feed a dial on the front of it, the voltage control labeled welding control is given to regulate the speed of the wire electrode feed. To the increase the speed of the wire electrode being fed with a spool, turn the dial on the L counterclockwise to decrease the amount of the resistance across the arc or the left of the wire motor to return fast and turning the dial clockwise. Clockwise will increase the amount of the resistance, thereby increasing the speed of the wire electrode being fed with a spool. Three at the ends of the wire electrode touch with the workpiece between the 50 and 100 volts direct current generated. The voltage is picked up with the high voltage pickup of the cable to shunt back of the voltage control box into the transformer. The transformer steps down the voltage 24 volts direct current. Remember the operation from the torch motor. A fuses. Two, two, 10 amp fuses located in the front of the voltage control box protect the control of the electric circuit within the volt control, voltage control box. Two and one amp fuse located with the front of the voltage control box protects the control of the torch motor. Installing wire electrode will open the cover of the spool and closure with the break of the pressure of the roll assembly shown in figure nine and page twenty six. Unroll the straight and six inches of the wire electrode on top of the spool. Feed the straight end of the wire electrode from the inlet outlet bushings play for the spool on the bottom shaft. Close the pressure roll secure in place, press the inch button feeding the electrode until there is one half of the inch protruding beyond the end of the nozzle. Setting up the argon pressure, flip the argon switch in the front of the voltage control panel with the manual position. Turn the argon cylinder valve to set up the pressure on the regulator. When the pressure, proper pressure is set on the regulator, fill, flip the argon switch to the automatic position. When the argon switch is placed in the manual position, the argon gas continues to flow until the turn off of the valve when in the automatic position. The argon gas flows only with the torch trigger, the depression the stop flowing, then the torch trigger is released. H generator generator polarity and proper over operation of the torch motor of the generator must be served so on reverse polarity. If the generator is set on the straight polarity, the torch motor will run in the reverse, withdrawing the wire electrode from the torch gun and causing the severe burn back on the, the torch. Reclaiming um, burn back contact tubes. When contact tubes are new, they are five three eighths of an inch long. The burning back occurs with the minimum of three eighths of an inch may be filled off with a file with a flat spot on the top of the guide table to, uh, tube that uses the appropriate size and drill pilot. Drill to drill out in contact tube with the example of the 364th inch of the uh, contact tube using the number 4647 drill bit. Alright, J. Welding operations. Any furious, non furious metal can be welded through the use of the MIG welding process. The hard welded metals, such as aluminum, magnesium, titanium, must be welded either by the MIG or TIG welding processes. MIG welding process, you have the filler rod, the use of the welding thicker metal, particularly with the thick aluminum, the TIG welding process, the use of the welding thinner metal with the with or without the use of the filler rod. Penetrate for the metal and the type of the joints used for the MIG welding operation are the same as the modification five basic joints discussed in paragraph 4G, beginning on page 14. A more detailed discussion of the five basic joints is contained in 
Command 9237. Conclusion. The task describing the principal operation of equipment and nomenclature safety precautions pertaining to the tungsten and air gas metal arc welding process. There are two newly developed welding processes that have been, recently have been adopted use of the Army field and field. The next task, the next task describes the procedure of troubleshooting and repairing welding equipment. Lesson one: An air welding west. Safety precautions: uh, An air gas welding principle. Safety precaution: Gas metal welding principle. Operational equipment nomenclature procedure: Troubleshooting welding equipment and determining methods of repair. Uh, we're on ninety-four.